Hey everyone, my name is Marco Carradine. I'll be talking about this book called Black. The author of this book, his the author of the book name is Quan, and the artist of this book, his name is Jamal Eagle. What I like the most point about his artwork because it's very detailed. And because he played with the artworks with the characters. Okay, the book is about how Crane was a victim of police brutality. Because he was accused of robbing a restaurant at gunpoint. He ended up meeting with Jeremiah. And joining this group called Project S, but but he found out Project S are putting their own people in jail. So Kareem Jenkins left the group to do his own thing. I think this book is racist to me because every white person in this book accused an innocent black young man of a crime they didn't do. Just because they fit the description of the crime. Like for example. The post officer got a report saying three suspects is robbing a restaurant at gunpoint and his young male is wearing shorts wearing shorts and a t-shirt. It was so happened, Kareem and his friends was walking down the street with typically shorts and t-shirt in a hot summer day. Then the cruiser post officer put up on Kareem and his friends with guns pointing to put, keep your hands up in the sky and don't move. Kareem and his friends were just standing there looking confused like what's going then on. Kareem's friend quoted, these cops are going to kill us and that's sick later. The groups of cops shot at Kareem and his friends. This is another example right here. These groups of white men right here Tied this black man up to a tree, about to set him on fire, just because they assume they just just because they assume he set one of their houses on fire, and that's not true at all. Also, he was an all-state quarterback, and all the ladies loved him. So there's one particular white lady he was talking to, whatever, and that she ended up in his house. The house was the house burnt down. She died. She and she died in the house fire. So all the white people in the neighborhood thought. He killed her. This book basically sounds like how black people need to rise up, and most importantly, black lives matter because like it's too many racist white guys, racist police officers, just shooting innocent black people for no reason just because they fit the description, just because they fit the description of a crime or something like that. And Doc, this book, like the cover of the book right here, is like a perfect example of a a young black man with a hoodie on with his hands up. Like, perfect example, like how Mike Brown, he had no weapons on him. And, oh, yeah, his hands straight up. And the police officer shot him for no reason. Just because, like, he, because he was big. Like, because he, he was big and black. Like, that doesn't make any sense. But anyway, nice talking to y'all. And y'all have a good day.